you can load any scene from any script using this instruction and you only need to know the exact name of the scene or the build index of the scene that is defined in the build settings window. Alternatively, you can declare this first part at the top of the script to use a shorter instruction. Don't forget to like and subscribe before you leave. Now, if you stay with me a little longer, I'm going to show you how to load a scene by pressing a canvas button, but you need to give me a minute to prepare all we need. I'm going to create two scenes, main menu and level one. Add these scenes to the build settings window, main menu first. In the main menu scene, I add a button to load level one. I create a new script to do the job and an empty emotic to assign the script. Otherwise, the script won't be executed no matter how hard we try. Inside the script, I define a public function named load level one, which will be called when pressing the button. For now, inside this function, I just print something in the console. To make the button execute this function, in the onclick event of the button, I add a new element, drag the game object with the script to this field, and choose the function we previously defined. When I run this and press the button, we see the message in the console, meaning our function has been called. If you can't make the buttons work, check this other video in the corner. So, we have all we need, now we're gonna load the scene inside our function. We use the instruction we saw at the beginning, unityengine.sceneManagement.sceneManager.loadScene and between parentheses, pass the name of the scene you want to load. Let's run it and press the button. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next video.